Here we go, just one weekend left in the WCHA regular season, and still the playoff positions are very much up in the air. Minnesota remains tied for second place with North Dakota, two points behind St. Cloud, and just four points ahead of seventh place, Denver. In Minnesota's final two regular season of home games last weekend, a brutal Friday night loss to Denver by a 2-0 final was reversed with a very impressive 5-1 win in the Saturday rematch. A reshuffled Gopher lineup thrived as the Gulfs piled up 43 shots and had a two-goal, two-assist performance from captain Zach Budish and a three-assist night from leading scorer Eric Haula. Now the closest race in the 61-year history of the WCHA will come down to the final two games. Potential playoff scenarios, even with just two games left, are just too numerous to decipher. However, because of their highly successful season overall, Minnesota will have home ice for the first round of the playoffs and could finish anywhere from first to sixth. The Gophers will now conclude their last ever WCHA regular season with two games at Bemidji. The Beavers have struggled scoring goals, securing one win in the last 16 games, and are coming off a loss and a tie at North Dakota. Minnesota remains the highest scoring and number two ranked team in the nation. The Gophers need to be in playoff mode and play up to their potential this weekend for an advantageous playoff seating. For Gopher Sports, I'm Wally Shaver.